my god, we're back. We're here. We're doing this now. Oh god, so Stampy Cat, Dan, and Lizzie, is that name? Are prime suspects, but apparently Lucas gets the dodge because he's our buddy, yada yada yada. At uh, murder. Mystery thing. Does this painting have eye holes? Oh yeah. How'd I not notice that before? Seems worth taking a closer inspection. Oh. Are you kidding me? It's some sort of secret passageway. Very clever. What do you suppose that lever does? Stand out of the way, everybody. Everyone, make sure you're nowhere near that arrow trap. One of those potion covered arrows. Nasty. Well, seems like we found out how the white pumpkin killed Torto. Yeah, and how he's getting around the house. I assume we're investigating the creepy passageway? I think we've come too far to turn around now. Correct. Uh, Let's go. After you then. Get smart. You'll be the last man. If anyone gets murdered, he gets to run first. Actually, maybe that's not the smart position. The smartest place to be oh, is the person in the middle. Locked up in the library. We could have put them in even bigger danger. What if there are more traps in there? Well, even if it isn't the right person, at least he's safe. Guess that makes sense. Sort of. What do you think that is? No idea. But look, a lever. I'm guessing that must activate another trap. Maybe one that's visible through that peephole. See anything that this lever might be connected to? Huh. Oh, the damn right. <gasps> what do you see? It's the library. I see Dan locked up in there. It's Cassidy. Green eyes were in this painting last time I saw. Lizzie, what are you doing in here? I snuck in past that blonde guy. Lucas, I think. We have to talk. About what? I know you pushed the button. No, that's not true. You don't have to lie to me, Dan. I know it was an accident. I know you're not the white pumpkin. Oh, thank goodness. That's such a relief. Yeah, it was an accident, and I felt awful about it ever since. Oh, it's such a relief to be able to talk about this. It's been absolutely tearing me up inside. I'm sure. I just... Haven't you learned anything about not pushing buttons? Oh, come on. Nothing like this has ever the happened when I push the button. I feel there. just... Then let's go kick his butt. Butt. Keeping someone safe is far more important than trying to figure that out. Because we could just make them pay more for making us have to do this. you from the walls we need to talk oh no 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 you heard the part where i said it was an accident right 
I'm innocent. What do I have to do to make you believe me? I could... I could go and sit in the corner very quietly and not touch anything, button or otherwise, for the whole rest of the night. Don't worry, Dan. I believe you. Oh, that's a relief. That's a huge relief. Wait. You came out of that portrait in the wall, right? Yeah. I saw one just like that upstairs. What if... Yes. Maybe the white pumpkin... <laughs> Join the party. <laughs> That's my cue. Oh, you're the best. Jesse, are you okay? I have to break through. <laughs> It's not letting me- Oh, I almost used the wrong arrow. That's why it was working. Is this death run? Soul sand. Oh, shit. Go, honey, go! Go! Hit him and Jesse. No! Lucas. Hey, give me a moment. I'm trying to figure this one out myself. What happened, Lucas? I thought you were chasing the white pumpkin. Uh, yeah, I was, and I almost had him until you know he took me by surprise and stuffed this pumpkin on my head. Well, what's going on in here? No! Huh? You called the white pumpkin! Grab him, quick! On it! Get out of our way, Jesse. Yeah, it's all out in the open now. You can't defend your friend anymore. No, no, no. I know what's going on here, and I won't stand for it. One of you is still the white pumpkin, and you're trying to pin it on Lucas. Yeah, bold words. Especially coming from someone with a knack for locking up innocent people. It's the facts, Jesse. These horrible things only started happening when your group arrived. And now, Lizzie is gone too. I say we throw him outside and let nature take its course. What? Out outside, outside? Where all the goonies mm. are? No, you can't do that. Yeah, uh, I don't what? know. I still have my suspicions about Lucas, but Jesse did save me. And you tried to save Lizzie. I don't feel right about chucking your friend to the zombies. <laughs> Brave stats. <sighs> Thank you. See, you all heard Dan, right? Fine. Hmm. <sighs> Thank you. Don't go celebrating yet. We've still got to do something with you so you're not roaming around freely. What? Like, lock me up in a closet or something? There was a closet in the main hall with a lovely metal door. Seems like a perfect place to lock someone up. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> I was mostly joking. I guess that's fair. But I'm keeping guard because I still don't trust him. That cool with everyone? That's not happening unless one of us goes along too. It's fine, Jesse. I'll watch over Lucas. Awesome. <laughs> Come on, Cassie. But don't go getting any funny ideas, blonde guy. This isn't because I like you or anything. <laughs> no, of course not. Be quiet. Prisoners aren't supposed to talk. Okay. Well, what are we supposed to do now? We need to figure out how we're going to clear Lucas's name. And I'd like to do it sooner rather than later. Seems like some of these people are getting a little stir-crazy. 
Somehow, the White Pumpkin was able to escape that room when Lucas chased him into it. We need to figure out how he did that. Sounds like a plan to me. Okay, uh, look at you. Mm. Hmm. Someone with a convenient staircase. It's big and. <gasps> Whoa! Another secret passage. Well, this looks promising. I wonder what order these need to be in. Oh, wrong one. Arrow goes there. Okay, that seems like a step in the right direction. And you... We're right after this. Hmm, yeah, that seems right. Hi, Mabel. There we go. Awesome. Hmm. Oh, wow! You got it open! Yeah, you guys should stay here. Could be dangerous. No, I totally want to follow you into your friend's creepy secret passageways. Ugh, seriously? You really think Lucas did it? You haven't it? proven that he didn't yet. Hey, come on, cool it. We're all in this together, aren't we? Depends. Figured you'd be on your little buddy's side. Ugh. You know what? They're not worth it. Come on. Wow, that is deep. Guess it leads down to whatever the White Pumpkin calls home. I wonder how he gets down there. Maybe in addition to walking through walls, he can fly for all we know. Ugh! It's just... I'm really worried about Lucas. Those people think they're all safe, but the White Pumpkin is still running around, and he could strike again at any minute. Not to mention, all those people back there have been so ungrateful, so petty. Hey, Petra, I understand, okay? I'm with you. You're right. I know you're right. <sighs> Sorry, Jesse. I just really needed to get that off my chest. Oh no, preach, We're sister. Get through this. Let's start by preaching to the choir at the moment. Down there, huh? You know the drill. What have you got in your inventory? Didn't you have all those wood blocks? Sorry, I was whittling earlier. Nervous habit. Well, luckily, those should do just the trick. You thinking ladder? Oh, yeah. Gonna need a lot of them. I'll race you. <laughs> You're on. <laughs> Done. Don't. Oh, man. <laughs> Thanks. I needed that. All right. We've got a lot more of these to make. Let's get to work. Okay, that's one down. Lots more to go. <sighs> and a whole lot more. See? Told you we'd make it. Yeah, I just hope this works. You think we're gonna find the white pumpkin down here? these secret passageways I'll be honest I hope we do and this time he's not getting away unscathed oh I should have said he's upstairs Brutal. I like it hey do you hear lots and lots of zombies yeah I do I'm starting to smell them too Ugh, ditto gross Explains all the 
those zombie noises. And there's a zombie spawner in there. What in the world is that? There's three of them. Whoa. Some sort of like zombie spawner. Does that mean the white pumpkin actually made the sea of zombies outside? That's what it looks like. What's that? I think this is where people's stuff goes after those hoppers upstairs suck it up. You're right. I think that's Lizzie's. Where's the loot going from here? Hopefully, right to the White Pumpkin. Hmm. Hey, you see the light coming out of that tunnel too, right? Huh? Oh, yeah. And it doesn't look like it's blocked off like all the, uh, zombie-filled ones. If we can get up there, I think we might be able to follow the loot to wherever it's going. Well, that's awesome. Nice find. How do you want to get up there? Grab some dirt, Petra. We're going climbing. All right. Oh, what? Whoa. Okay. I think we're going a little closer. <laughs> Come on, lady. Gotcha. Oh. That was almost embarrassing. Thanks, Jesse. No problem. Well then. Weird. That's a cat. That almost sounds like cats. Whoa. I'll buy no pumpkins. Sort of growing station. Weird. Stampy. The pumpkin must have hurt us. <laughs> Stampy cat? Boy, you gave me a fright. What are you doing down here? What are we doing down here? Yes, it looks terribly suspicious, you know. We're trying to find the white pumpkin. Oh, well, I'm glad you haven't run into him yet. Come on, you guys. I can't be the white pumpkin. I'm Stampy Cat. I'm no murderer. Huh? I needed to find you because I have something important to tell you. I have something to confess. Something I haven't told anyone. Where is this going? No, oh, Petra. I stole it from Dan. It was just supposed to be a joke, a harmless prank, but then, well, you've seen what happened. Wow, who would have thought? I knew people wanted it, but I had no idea that, that this would happen. Wow, Stampy Cat with the enchanted flint and steel. Didn't see that one coming. Definitely suspicious. I know, and that's why I had to keep it a secret. I may be a thief, but I'm no killer! But that white pumpkin is, and he's killing people for it! And now, we're down in his lair! I was thinking, maybe I should just give it to the white pumpkin. What? Just, maybe that would make it all stop, right? Maybe? First, we need to figure out who this white pumpkin really is. Then we'll figure out what to do from there. I, I suppose that's a better strategy. 